about the fact that, hey, this would be a fourth win in a row over your rival if you can get it done Thursday night? Yeah, I mean, it's, um, it's, always, it's always great beating them. Um, but, you know, it'd be, it'd be a good win for us, too, uh, just, you know, for how they're doing, uh, where they're at. Um, so, you know, it's all just, you know, about, about winning and, um, you know, peaking at the right time. So uh, a win against them would just, you know, again, give us momentum, uh, move forward to close out the season strong. We haven't had a chance to talk to you since last week. What was it like to have to sit when they said, you're out of here? <laughs> um, that, I, I thought it was fake. You know, I'm not even got a technical, so uh, it just didn't seem real. You know, I went to go sit on the bench, you know, just thinking, I don't, I don't know what was going on. And um, then they escorted me into the locker room and watched the game on my phone. So uh, it was strange, just it happens, you know. Uh, I, I really appreciate Sean Miller uh, and the words he said, or just kind of knowing that shouldn't happen. Uh, and so, you know, I think he said a lot of great things. And uh, I think a lot of people believe that as well, that it was just kind of a call that shouldn't have been made, should never happened. Um, but it did. So just got to live with it. Did you have a monitor in the locker room? Uh, no. My mom came back there, and we were watching the game. So, so um, the clock's ticking. Are you feeling that, hey, you know, regular season's close now, and then you got the big you know, Pac-12 tournament? I mean, uh, as a senior and a, a long-time successful player here, what's that like? I uh, just want to finish on a high note. Uh, you know, as we always talk about, you know, we dropped some games that uh, we wish we didn't, you know, and can't have any more learning experiences. Uh, so it's time to really just... I guess get get the momentum and peak at the right time. 